For the city of Hayward, I mean, in California, California law um, limits what is what kind of information about evictions is publicly available. So most of the county courts don't have any data available. Um, initial requests for information from the city were, you know, turned away. You have to know the parties of the eviction in order to be able to request the information. So it seemed like an impossible task to be able to get the information. But being part of this process and knowing the opportunity we had, um, we started the process knowing we had some records based on notices of terminations that were being filed. Um, but we decided to make one last attempt to see if we could get better data. And so we reached out to our Board of Super Supervisors office um, that represents Hayward and asked them if they had any connections in the county court's office. Um, and they connected us with the executive officer who then explained the administrative process for requesting public records through the courts and what the limitations were and what specific data we could ask for um, and who the proper contacts were. So we were able by you know, going above our above to our county um, board of supervisors, we were able to leverage the right contact to be able to access some while still limited access information that is definitely showing us kind of the volume and magnitude of, of evictions in Hayward. And as Lauren kind of pointed out, looking at that historical data, knowing where it was in 2019, we can see that it's it's dropped in during our moratoria and then trying to make sure that it doesn't go up back up to those high levels once the, the eviction moratoria have ended.